Is Bitcoin the currency of the future or is it the payment system they're developing? Bingo, it's the payment system. It's the blockchain encryption and they're, they're interesting things. Bitcoin and things like it is the equivalent of the red pill. Okay? We are entering a completely world of uncharted water. Have right you now. made any investments in Bitcoin? So, I mean, I personally, I own Bitcoin in my hedge fund. I own Bitcoin in my fund. I own Bitcoin in my private account. This is a currency, a currency that's really going to work eventually. Well, I think it is working. Um, and uh, there will be other currencies like it that may, may be even better. There is no Bitcoin company. There is no uh, Bitcoin building. There's even, not even a Bitcoin server anywhere that you could shut down. For you and me to exchange money online, we had to employ a third party like PayPal, like Visa, like MasterCard. This is better than currency in that uh, you don't have to ha be physically in the same place. And of course, for large transactions, currency can, can get pretty inconvenient. And the credit card company costs the retailer three to six. Right, because they reject the, well, first the fee is, is high, and then they reject the transaction because why is this card suddenly showing up in some city, some place where I don't live? So it gets cut off. Well, with blockchain cryptography, the buyer and the seller automatically trust each other over an untrusted network. That's what's so powerful about it. So Bitcoin's already had its big run up to where it is right now, right? The early execution, the first 10,000 executions of QR codes in that market brought value. It was like you could buy stuff from the subways, uh, you could get a, a really interesting exclusive content, it was utilitarian, it was entertainment. Reported to be a $2.1 billion industry and as I describe it to you, you're gonna be like, what? Let's talk about virtual currency. What right. is for us? Okay, so for us is a, a global digital exchange. What does that mean? Well, um, what we did was we've created a platform where we can bank the entire world on a single uh, uh, blockchain mm -hmm. exchange, which means we can now um, include all of the three and a half billion unbanked people in the world and provide them with free banking. So you say, what is for us? It's free banking. Uh, we have, uh, for us, runs uh, a, what we call a public utility blockchain. So we've created a blockchain that everybody can use, governments, banks, insurance companies, medical aids, you can store your data securely um, and encrypted and available to everybody. So kind of, you know, the payments industry, they used to be the big boys, but now, now they're not. So we're taking the power back.